welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Hello, hi, I'm Katie, and welcome back if you're a subscriber. You guys are the best. If you are new here, then please consider subscribing if you enjoy today's video. If you're excited for today's Glamify review, please hit that thumbs up button now. Um, I'm very excited. It's a company I've seen a lot of on Instagram. And you know what it's like. You're like, what's it like? What's the quality like? Is it worth the money? Like, do I want to go and buy these things? And without actually doing it yourself, that's what I'm here for. So, today's Glamify review, I'm very excited to be sharing with you. It's all things I've purchased myself. I'm going to give my honest feedback. And KT 2021 is going to be a little bit more honest than 2020, okay? So, I am typically a very positive person, which sometimes means that I will get a bit excited and like not want to hurt anyone's feelings but at the same time like I'm here to give you guys a review so you're gonna get a review okay before I get on to the clothing I am oh, I am just gonna share these little babies with you because I ordered these because I couldn't resist they were down to something like 28 I think to like eight pound or seven pound fifty um so they're just a furry fluffy slipper they're like they're like a a slider um however i'm just gonna put out that the quality of them is not fantastic they're not gonna last you forever they'll probably be like a a few months wear out of them so that is you know my feedback on them however for the price of seven pound fifty or eight pounds i do think they're gorgeous i do think they're adorable but i do think you'd be better off investing in if you can afford a better quality pair that will last you longer, which is all what I'm about this year. I'm trying my best to only keep pieces that I think, all right, even though it's only £7.50, which sounds like such a bargain, and my old self would be like, Katie, how can you not keep them? They are the most cute, adorable things I've ever seen in my life. My new, more sensible self is saying, take them back. They, even £7.50, unfortunately, it's not worth it. I mean, if you don't wear slippers maybe as much as I do, because I live in them, then you might be all right. But I literally live in them like I'm wearing a pair now. So just gonna, yeah. I also picked up another pair to try. Now these are a little bit more expensive and they are a little bit more heavy duty, as you can see on the bottom. They're also a lot thicker. So I'm thinking these might last you a little bit longer. They also feel like a lot firmer. As you can see, they've got like no bend in. Um, so these are, I think about 20 pound. And I think these will be a better option to go for if you're looking for more a more um, like sustainable pair. If you're just looking for something cute to pop on so you feel really cute around the house. Like if, if you're not home much, like if you're not working from home at the minute, then maybe go for the other pair. If you're like at home all the time, I'd say go for something like these. They both, they both, they all, they both come in like lots of different colours as well. These are obviously just the ones I picked up. You guys know I love, I'm literally wearing them for some right now. They're very, very similar. So I won't be keeping these for that exact reason, but I just wanted to sort of buy them to see what the quality was like and to give you guys like my best review. So let's get into the clothes. The bit that you guys are probably here for is gonna be the loungewear. I feel like I see it everywhere, all over Instagram. If I haven't seen a blogger in Glamify loungewear, I probably haven't been on my phone that day. That's what I'm saying. So, I got a bit to get through, so let's just get straight into it. Let's just go. So the slippers were seven pounds fifty for the dark ones, they're only eight pounds, sorry, for the cream ones. So definitely on quality wise, I would go for the cream. Um, I want to just get my phone to tell you guys the prices of these pieces. So we're going to start with a pistachio coloured loungewear because I feel like loungewear can be quite boring. If you stick to all the neutrals and all the, you know, blacks, which we do do because typically we think we won't get bored of them. However, I feel like adding a little bit of colour in, now spring is arising. It's not really yet. I know it's still winter, but I feel like I'm ready for spring. I feel like I'm ready to get out of knitwear a little bit and just like get back into nice things. So add a little bit of colour like this. I especially think in springtime it would be lovely. So these are £45. I feel like a loungewear set. I think that's probably like the max, maybe £50 I would go because you are getting two pieces. Um, however, I do think the quality and how soft these are is amazing. So they come with a pair of matching trousers and this is like a slouchy off the shoulder, like little ribbed um, sort of like, I've not seen a jumper like this before and I think that's what I like. And I'm really liking the jumpers and like the knit dresses with zips at the minute. I think they're really, really cute and quite chic, quite effortlessly chic for like a piece of knitwear. 
So I love this and I think the, the fit is absolutely gorgeous. I picked this up in a size medium to large, I think. And just for reference, I'm a UK size 12 and I'm five foot nine. I'm not sure, I can't see where the tag is. But so I got it in a medium to large, which is, says 10 to 12, which would be a perfect size for me because I am a 10 to 12. Um, so then they come with like these very like thin, soft, lightweight leggings. Um, they're really, really soft. I just can't get over the quality of the material and how soft they are. I didn't expect it, if I'm honest. Um, when you see these sort of like newer brands, and I don't mean this unkindly, but they aren't always the best quality. I feel like the quality is something they have to sort of get to. But I think that does show with the price is £45. Maybe you could get like a set like this from Pretty Little Thing or something like that for like £20, which obviously the quality wouldn't be. And I've seen is not as good as this. So I'm really impressed. Um, I absolutely love this pistachio colour and I think pastels are going to be really really in in 2021. I absolutely loved wearing pastels last spring. Um, they definitely like made a huge comeback and I think that they will be in again for this year. Okay next I'm going on to this cream teddy bear coat. Now this kind of coat I've fancied for so long I've never actually bought myself a cream one. One because normally it rains where I live <laughs> and two just because I feel like I've got a pink one and I've got a brown one, so I kind of feel like I've got the neutral covered and the colour covered. However, I do think a cream one is just absolutely dreamy. I'm out of breath because I just ran downstairs to get the doorbell. <sighs> okay. So this one I've seen again on a few influ influencers on Instagram and I do really like it. I do think it's a nice one. This is actually, which surprised me, only £45, which I think is a really good price for a, a um, teddy coat. I mean, in Primark, which is the, probably the cheapest place you can buy a teddy coat right now, um, they're £35. So it's only £10 more, you're buying it online. I can't see like that it's a bad quality or a good quality. It's just a basic teddy bear coat. So I feel like you're probably paying for what you get. Um, I have... It has got some structure down it, which I didn't, again, expect. I do think it's really nice, but with a teddy bear coat, it kind of is what you see, what you was what you get. If you love them, you love them, and if you don't, you don't. I can't see them going out of style for a long time, so I think something, a nice lighter, creamy one, as we're coming into spring and it's still a bit cold, would be quite nice. And I've had my first teddy bear coat about two or three years now, and I still bring it out every year. So I don't feel like it's something that's going to be wasted and not going to come back in next year, because I did feel like, are they going to come back in this year? And then they did. So maybe not on a big scale as they have before, but I do think it is really lovely. And the classic colour, obviously, is going to just be really easy to wear. I like the way it's got black buttons as well, because it helps you tie in any black with it. So I'm quite impressed with that piece. So next I have the Gina Cream Long Sleeve Dress. Now again, I've just seen this so much on the social media um, in different colours. I think everything I'm sharing with you today comes in so many colours, so just bear that in mind if you like it but you don't like the specific colour that I'm sharing with you. Um, so this one I got in, what size did I get this? I got this again in a medium to large and I would say the fit on this was really nice. Um, it is. I did get it in the colour cream but it's very like custard creamy whereas I think in the photos it looks a little bit more like an off beige. You know like this sort of like sandy colour rather than like custard cream cream but it is custard cream cream. Um, however I do really like it, I do think it's really pretty. I think it's very flattering, it's got a nice little split up the leg. I love like ribbed midi dresses like this. I just think they're like easiest way to like really classy, really effortless. And again, they're just such a plain staple piece. I can't see them ever going out of style. Like there's nothing to dislike about it. It's very classic. It's very classy. And I just, yeah, I really, really like it. This is £32.50. I think I got this maybe in the sale. Oh, £32.40 I paid for it. So... I'm not sure if maybe they had a little sale on the time. However, I do think they quite often have sales on. They're one of those websites that always seem to have a sale on. So um, definitely have a little look, um, have a little browse. And yeah, I really like this. I really like this one. Okay, so we're on to another loungewear set. Now this is a little bit different. This is more like joggers and a, a jumper. However, they're the most flattering joggers and a jumper I've ever worn ever i feel like joggers are normally quite unflattering in the sense of like they're just puffy they don't really like show your shape at all they don't really like show off anything about your figure however this is like the most flattering thing i ever put on 
I also am obsessed with this chocolate brown colour this year. I just think chocolate brown has really come in and like taken over a lot of colours. It's almost like a great alternative to black. If your whole wardrobe is black, your next new best friend is going to be dark brown because it just is a lovely addition to the wardrobe. It's also really nice to like match with neutrals. Um, so yeah, I really, really like this and I was so impressed with how flattering it was and the fit. It says I got this in a large. Let me just check. I got this in a large, which apparently is a 12 and it was £40 for the set. I would happily pay that for this. I think it's really great quality. It's got a little bit of fluff all over it from the coat I'm going to show you in a minute. I, I literally just popped it on over it and it's just covered it in this fluff. I don't know how. But anyway, I do absolutely love this. And like I said, it comes in like cinched in at the waist here. So it's much more flattering than like a big baggy, heavy um, jogger set. And then the bottoms are the same. So they come in, they're very like flattering around the waist as you can see here. They're high waist um, and they've got this V. I don't know what it is, it just makes it super flattering. And then they're like nice and ankle cuffed at the bottom. So I really, really like those. Really, um, really, really impressed with Glamify's, Glamify's lounge wear. Okay, so next I have this ribbed body, which I think is absolutely beautiful. I picked it in the black colour, however, like I said, it comes in lots of different colours. And they also have them without the body and like a bit that just hangs out, which actually looks quite nice. I'm not sure how flattering it would be um, on my figure, but maybe something to try in the next video. Um, so this one I got in a size, don't tell me again. <laughs> I got this in a size medium to large and this was £20. What I love about this is the shape of the neckline. If you guys aren't new here, you'll know that I really love anything that's like a little bit of a different neckline. I just think it makes a classic piece such as like a black ribbed body just something a little bit different but without being too different that you won't want it in a, in a year or so, if that makes sense. So it's kind of like adding a bit of a zhuzh to the more everyday pieces in the wardrobe. Um, I love the, the shape of this body. What I would say, if anyone is a tall girl like me, so five foot nine or above, the body length was quite like slightly snug, slightly short, um, slightly uncomfortable, so perhaps wouldn't go for the body if you are over five foot eight, I would probably say, or if you know you specifically have like a longer torso. I actually would think I normally have longer legs than I have a longer torso, but this is this is definitely more for like um, I'd say your petite to average height size. Um, it is beautiful and for twenty pound I think it's a lovely like staple piece for the wardrobe. So definitely something if you're looking for like nice base layers, under layers that are still chic. You know, like when you get a bit hot and flustered and you want to take your jumper off, but then you still want to look nice underneath. Something like that's perfect. The next I got some more loungewear, but we're going back to the basics again with the black. So this is just a really chic, um, shorter, a lot shorter in the body black knitwear loungewear <laughs> black loungewear set and um, again super flattering i really really love how flattering these pieces are as you can tell because i keep going on about it um i just think i'm so surprised by it i just didn't have the highest expectations because quite a lot of online brands that i hadn't tried before when they've come i've been quite disappointed in the quality but this i really wasn't i really was impressed um, so it's got these like cap little shoulders which I really really like I just like the fact that it's plain and simple but it's just got something again comes in loads of different colors really really lovely um, and then it's got these nice high-waisted like these are a lot thicker quality than the other ones with a pocket and um, they're again high-waisted and they come in to a little um, like cinched in bottom as well which I always think just like elongates the leg and makes it a little bit more flatter than just like things that don't fit in at the bottom. I don't know what it is, I just think it looks way nicer. That loungewear set is £36, and I think it would look great with a little fluffy sliders at the start. <laughs> okay, so this dress I haven't actually tried on, um, and the reason I didn't try it on was because I knew I would get makeup on the neckline. Um, it is a very high neck ribbed maxi midi dress. The reason I didn't try it on was because I realised I actually already have one just like it and I didn't feel like the need to try it on. However, I can see that it would be lovely and flattering the same as the cream midi that I showed you earlier. So it literally is a roll neck, um, like long sleeve, but for me it's a little bit more like an off-white than a cream. Um, this was down to £8 in the sale, which is an absolute bargain. Obviously the lighter colour is going to show things like lumps and bumps, so if you're someone who's conscious of those areas, then just bear that in mind. Not that anyone should be, we should all be embracing our bodies, but at the same time, you dress what makes you feel the best, and I always think, no matter what that is for, for someone, that's what you should do. So, 
Um, yeah, I really, really like it, and I just think that eight pounds is an absolute steal. Again, so it was never going to go out of style, so it was effortlessly chic, really classy, and just like a lovely long, long lined um, dress. This also would look great with some like little boots, but also you could wear it around the house. I love like knitted dresses just to wear around the house as well. I think they're really comfy, but like you just look chic as well. So really nice little like yeah, eight pound bargain. Okay, so this oh. This is the coat that left fluff all over that jump uh, that <laughs> that other loungewear set, the brown one. I don't I don't know how. It must like have inside fluff in that just managed to come out. I think it's like the duvet material. It must must be within there that it's managed to come out anyway. But this is um, a really gorgeous, like I'm obsessed at the minute with these puffer long jackets. I just think they look like duvet coats, aren't they? And they literally are like wearing a duvet. They're so comfy and cozy, which you guys know is my thing. I really like the colour of it. I think it's a little bit different, which I really like. I've not seen this sort of like colour shade before. It's almost like a latte like a weak coffee colour. Um, I really, really like it, I really like it. Um, I got this in a large, so it was a little bit on the bigger side, but obviously if you're gonna be wearing layers, it's ideal. If you want it to be a bit more flatter and perhaps size down, has also got these poppers and buttons at the bottom at the sides, just to like do up and down. Um, because if you've ever worn one of these coats before, you'll know if they're quite long, they can be difficult to walk in unless the zip comes up at the bottom as well which i found out with one of my quiz ones in the previous haul if you haven't seen that quiz haul it's labeled christmas i think but it's just great pieces from the december range and they've still got all of them online a lot of them i think are in the sale now as well so definitely worth checking out we will have a quiz haul i think next week depending on when it arrives um but it's definitely definitely in the pipeline either next week or the week after for our sunday fashion hauls um, but yeah, I really like this. This was £70, so it's slightly higher, but as these are obviously very in this year, it's like their new sort of season stock, I think, and they do sell out quite quickly. They also do come in a few other colours, so very nice, but like I said, £70, which to be, to be fair, I have seen most places charge around that for a puffer jacket, so they're about on point with their pricing. Okay, I feel like I've saved one of my favourites right until now. Uh, this is one of my favourite loungewear sets that I've ever worn. I absolutely am just obsessed with the cardigan. I would wear this as like just a cardigan on its own, tucked into like some mom jeans on a daily basis. Doesn't need to be loungewear. This is just too beautiful to be worn only in the house. Look at the sleeves. They come in literally the luscious big balloon sleeve. They've got this really nice like plait detail, a really nice... Um, knitted detail on the arm there's so much going on here I absolutely love it however it's still like really neutral really cream really just like basic but with so much at the same time it's all I love I'm losing my voice um, it's got these cute little tortoiseshell buttons on I really love this and then this is like quite oversized quite chunky and then we've got a lovely pair of like nice fitted um, high-waisted again joggers to finish this look off actually I don't think these were that high-waisted were they? No, these aren't that high waisted. These are like mid rise, actually. Sorry. Um, they've also got like this pocket in quite a weird place. Like it's quite far forward, so it's like not really something you would actually probably use. Probably just more for like how it looks. Um, but I'll show you the detail of the pocket. It's quite cute. It's something quite different. And then again, they come in at the bottom, which is my favourite kind. And um, I really like these. I got these in a size medium to large again, and these were forty pounds. And I'm pretty sure these are part of their newer range, so I think that's why these ones are forty pounds as well. But I do really like them. And I do think, like I said, that cardigan alone is worth forty pounds without the without the matching jogger. So I think that's a really nice. Um, it's probably my favourite loungewear set so far. I've got one more loungewear set, set to show you. I would love to hear your favourite item down below in the comment section. So if you haven't seen yet, we had last week we had a Zara sale haul that went live on Sunday, and the Sunday before was a full Zara haul. So there's a lot of Zara stuff on here at the minute, but I feel like they just they've got some great stuff in. So make sure you head and watch those after this video. Um, so this is the same as the pistachio one I showed you at the start. This also comes in black, which I think is super classy and really classic, and it is something I might consider actually I might send one of these back and get the black one instead because I just think it's really really flattering and just like really classic and timeless I don't know what it is I just I'm obsessed with these like zippy 
jumpers at the minute and especially these zippy jumper dresses I, I'm, a, I'm in love this is a lovely like soft dusky pink color you guys know i love pink if i'm gonna wear pink it's sort of this sort of muted shade or tone um, i don't often go for like bright things but i do love this one again i got it in the same size as the last one but i think was a medium to large and then the, the bottoms are the same the bottoms are very basic on these so they're very like just thin but so soft um so just like flattering on the legs i can't even tell you how flattering these were i just couldn't i just couldn't believe it it was the most flattering lounge i've ever ever tried hands down um so this would have been both um so that one is 45 pounds so that one i think is one of their new ones again and it's called that one's called the jesse range they've actually got like a girl's name for every sort of item of clothing so it's a lot easier to type in on their website and find um so what i will do is leave the names of them down below for you to um, be able to find them nice and easily on their website if you do want to shop anything. So um, I'll also leave them in order of how I've shown you them. So everything, like I said, will be down below in the description box. Um, and if there's anything you guys want to see here, then please feel free to ask. Just leave me a comment down below or pop over to my Instagram at with love Katie and leave me a message over there. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Let me know your favourite in the comment section below. And I'll see you on Wednesday for another video. Thank you so much for being here. Bye!